Hello and welcome to this the Zero AD Champions Cup Game 6. We are this time viewing <laughs> Feldfeld as the Ptolemies and Borg as the Brightons. Six ladies and six ladies. Okay. Oh my lord, what just happened? <laughs> um, was, was that a bug or what? I'm, I'm fairly certain Borg didn't click a million times in one second just now. Fairly certain. Running the dog around. Baskets for Feld and not for Borg. Yeah, that's usually how that goes. So the map that we're dealing with here is this. There is only one route between the bases. Are there peacocks here somewhere? Oh, here. <laughs> they got the sound right. That's 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 certainly what they sound like. They're annoying those things. <laughs> They're very pretty. Um, yeah, you, to go around here and then across here is the only way to get from one side to the other. Going for the iron axe heads. Sending some ladies up there to make a dock or something? Yes. for the Borg. DSD? 
If uh, Borg is the Borg, then Feldfeld would be the Federation. If keeping, if in keeping within the Star Trek analogy. He's got his camel over there honking away, doing its honking. There are quite a many honking animals on this map. Camels and peacocks and other such things, such as this. Such as these. Axe heads now for Borg. Population about even, resources about the same. Dock out for Feldfeld. Borgs is still yet to come, but not far away. Okay. More stall houses. Oh, what was this? Okay, field field going to two. Borg grabbing. Servants. Both players having scouted the map are anticipating the other to block off that one possible route in and out and they are both going for the long game in response. In response to the map conditions. Feldfeld Feld with the first boat out, attacking the dock. Another boat coming, camel archers. A raiding party via boat. Borg rings the bell. Either that or manually garrisons inside that house. I think it was a manual garrison. Only ever manual garrisoning. Ring the bell is bad. If you can avoid it, unless there are literally enemies all around your town center from every direction, civic center or whatever. Field field, ten away in population. Getting the ship hull strength upgrade. 
reinforced hull, servants, and stronger added. And what's this? Wedge and mount, just upgrades is that this is going long. This is going into the long game. Let's get every upgrade. Let's chop down all these trees. Let's mine all this stuff. Collect every resource. And then use it to do things. Use it to do good things with, with it. Them. Wedge and mallet, stronger axe. Town phase, pop capped. Buildings going up. Feld, feld. 14 away in population. Attacking the dock. Many, many men on, on these. There are, um, the maximum amount of workers on each of these, well, on the, on the rock at least, not on the metal. Although now there are some more coming over. Storehouses everywhere. Collect all the wood quickly. Just storehouses everywhere. It's a nice one where it's angled there. Dock almost gone down, some bartering happening. He may be able to establish a trade route from there to the dock if he could keep it alive. House is getting smashed down everywhere. Fieldfield's not going to have much to worry about in terms of having to spend any money on them at the very least. More upgrades coming out. Baskets. Third phase for Borg. Gather train. Just you can assume that they're getting pretty basically every upgrade that pertains to resource collection and town upgrading to city and such things. These rocks look strange. Back over to Fell 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 Grabbing the Para style as these mud brick houses just take too long to build. They just take too long to build. Eighty seconds. A Celtic house goes up in thirty. So, yeah. The next hyperzamata undergirding. More hull reinforcement. Ship strength upgrade. Watch towering, and then the next far just upgrades. There will basically always be an upgrade being researched here. Fortress going up. More storehouses. Yes. 
Oh, he got wrecked by Gaia. Dang. Going for another dock. More upgrades. He needs to get another dock as that one is about to go. Three racks in total. Body armor, shaft mining. Body armor and sharp axe heads on the over on this side. Just the three, four racks. Same amount of racks on each side. I like this dock down here and this hole. Keeping control of this is nice. Fishing boats aren't fishing currently. I don't think there are any more fish to be fished. We probably should just delete those fishing boats. I'm not seeing any fish. He's built the uh, the lighthouse, and so now he sees everything nearby the water. He's got his hero out. Destroying some unnecessary things to build more. Oh, look at this, the attack's happening. It's happening. Four rams and 125 Celtic slingers <laughs> and 47 spearmen. Fortress going down in response. As yes, that um, lighthouse is very handy. He can just see this happening. How about this though? Feldfeld is population capped at the moment, so he can afford to throw a few units into this fight. He has almost collected all of the minerals by his starting area. Um, oops, that's not the button that I meant to press. Actually, show me that again. Wow. Sorry. <laughs> Ram just chasing a uh, thing there. All oh, this boat is going to go down in a very, in very short order. This is not helping. This is just, <laughs> this is just ridiculous. The population, the total population has decreased by about 200 in this fight, in this one fight. <laughs> 
I should have, um, I think it's, it's time to get off, uh, player perspective, because the important things are happening outside of where the micromanagement's happening. At the very least in the fights such as those. Six ladies. Yes, 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 uh, your boat is going to get wrecked by that guy's hero, bruh. Like, heroes are basically a siege weapon. Yeah, you... <laughs> huh. Almost took down the boat, I guess. Just throwing wood away at him. Just have... Uh, wood. Hero cavalry swordsman... Inside the boat. When garrison in a structure or siege engine, engine, hmm. no big. I thought there might have been a special advantage to him having done that, but it was just for the extra arrow. For the extra arrow. Yes, Feld, Feld, what are you doing? Come on, bruh. <laughs> no, I mean, to expect somebody to be keeping track of, what is it, uh, actually 300, basically, units at once is a bit of a stretch. I can forgive him for having three. <laughs> Three pikemen, or whatever they were, idle for a few seconds out of 300. See, so he just put. No. He'll notice them now, and now he'll do something with them. Or, or he's busy. Anyway, what's Bog doing? He's doing things that are bad for spectating. <laughs> I want to see what's happening. Here we go. The game is just starting to lag a little bit considering there are 600 units trying to path their way around all sorts of complicated arrangements. Okay. Let's just jump right into it. Oops. No. Let's make even more lag. By making the camera angle go that way. I need oh. Where is a camera angle with no trees in the way? <laughs> it's just red and blue. Let's, let's look at what these cannons are doing. Oh, we... Why did you have to back them up? 
just when I... Actually, how is that going now, the pop? Uh, yeah, they've both lost about 20 units. I barely know what's happening at this point. They're fighting each other. another 200 or so units that just evaporated. Field filled! His population just now! Wow, he was down at almost 200. It was at about 220 and then 50 of something came out from somewhere. Rams are very strong. Coming straight in onto the Civic Center now. He may be able to destroy one of the Rams. Counter attack happening over here. It's chaos now. It just is madness. they come off? No, I don't think they... Oh, no, they did. Wait, no, did they? Did he just lose 30? I think he did. How did that boat die so fast? It just... Whoa! Right, it's when the other ones get into range or whatever. Oh my lord. There are 131 slingers. And they are taking down boats in a matter of seconds. All the ranged upgrades. None of this other nonsense, just these and these. His strategy is to make slingers. What have the upgrades been like over here? He's heading towards it, but he doesn't have it, and that's why he's losing. <laughs> the other guy's slingers are stronger than his. They both have slingers, but Borg has stronger ones. I mean, did... Um, is it just from a single blacksmith, or did he go for a second? to get them out, those upgrades out quickly. No, just the one. He's just been keeping an eye on it. It's probably on a command key. And now a temple, which is healing all of 169. Just... Uh, uh, just 169 slingers. Nothing, no kind of major thing. This is one of those games where the playlist for the map runs out and the music stops. <laughs> like the map has only a few songs in the playlist and there's no repeat. So once it gets to the end of the playlist, it just stops. <laughs> Something like that, I'm not sure how that works. 
but it seems to be something along those lines. Catapulting down the temple a little bit, but there's rams on the boat. Coming over on the boat and just smash that was a really good, nice, nice little thing there. The garrisoning and ungarrisoning of rams on boats. And now just a big push, 36 of them over the river. Feldfield's still on 300 population. <laughs> the populations in this game. I think I should have turned my graphics settings down a, li a little or something. <laughs> because uh, it's a little... lag. Wow, there were trees here once. <gasps> Feld, Feld, you have 10,000 wood. Feld, Feld has 10,000 wood. He also has not very much metal or stone. Where is his market? Here. Feld, Feld, please. Click on your market, click here, then hold shift and click that a bunch of times. Oh my lord. That's the kind of thing that I would do. <laughs> Is uh, not spend all of my wood. Use that wood to get these upgrades, bro. Oh, bro. Oh, in hindsight, what well, it seems like it seems really simple, doesn't it? When you when you were playing, it's and you're having to deal with the Borg borging your Borg all up. Then I mean, it is a little difficult, but who? Oh, I mean, he even has the money for it. What's he doing? Get your upgrades, bro. It's just too chaotic. He keep this. Uh, all he can think of is slingers and, and the fact that they are bad <laughs> for his health. <laughs> he bought the fishing upgrade. There was no fish on this map, bro. There was like not very many. Hmm. How is the population going now? About even. Somehow he's pushed into these slingers a little bit just with these, uh, Skirmishes. 78 skirmishes. He is spending a little of this wood now. But, uh... Hmm... <laughs> this is just ridiculous. Um I'm going to go back to Observer. I'm going to 
do this to see if it helps the lag a little. It does a little. Exactly even in population. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I get it. ESD. Whatever. Desperate for a dog. Oh, he did it. Now get... Now do it again and get this upgrade. We'll do it with stone. I didn't realize that that took stone, actually. Military colonies. He'll be back to 300 soon, yeah. <laughs> Six catapults sitting inside. Can they hold 40? Wow. That's a lot. Look at these resources here. I'll put the camera somewhere where you can... Oh, here we go. Look at these resources. There's 12,000 total wood <laughs> in possession. In combined possession. Here's the rams, here they are. Oh man, it can't be far now. I'm gonna re just relax it. Just to see what's happening here. Because when it's on relaxed, it almost looks like it's not lagging. A bit of deja vu there for Borg. 
and and fulfilled filled. A civic center going down right there. It was right here earlier. Going right for the next one. And then it'll be this one. A stuck ram? It's never fun. These rams, are these rams upgraded or what? Or is that just regular ram strength? I think it's just regular. Going for an expansion, military colony. There's a storehouse over here that has reverted to Gaia because this was destroyed and now these guys can't put their stuff inside. This way you can kind of see what's happening in both places. So here's the, the units from over there while you're seeing the fight over here. I say fight, I should say just every fight, all of the fights. This is too many rams now. That's seven rams. It's GG. <laughs> what do you do against seven rams? He has some catapults, I guess. But when the rams arrive here, Feldfeld will lose. <laughs> that's, that's simple. I mean, if... I can't see them not... Oh, no, he might be able to... Destroy them? What? What's he doing? Do they go... What? Um, okay, well... Oh, wow, now there's more rams. Yeah, mm. he doesn't have anything for that. He can't win this. That's nine rams. He can't beat. I mean, he's got the use these. I mean, meh. they're not. They are not as useful as battering rams in a one versus one fight. <laughs> oh no! Now they're all. Oh. The Rams are gonna. Mm. Yeah, good game, well played. You got the military colony down. But now the fortress down, that will decay. Hmm. Now it's the three all. It all comes down to this. Game seven. Best four of seven. That sure is a lot. A lot. How many units? Wow. Wow. Wow, that actually though. It was pretty even. Just 20 difference. Hmm. It's not how what your population is, 
It's what does your population consist of? What is inside of your army? What types of things do you have? Look at all these vegetables. What does that mean, vegetarian ratio? Buildings, units, resources, no mark, no trade income. Stone exchanged, metal exchanged. 66,000 wood collected. But only 30,000 of food. Yeah, the um, that fields thing that the uh, Brightons have is very strong. The rotary grain mill thing. Rotary mill. Wow. Okay, how about that? That was a game and a half. All right. I hope that was enjoyable. I'm sorry, it was a bit framey. Uh, it's somewhat the nature of the game when you get that many units on the field at once. It starts to get a, get a little bit like that. Um, yeah, but I think you can just turn the graphics down and that helps that a little bit though. Uh, yeah, I hope you have a good one and peace.